This animal is not supposed to be alive. Welcome back, Charlie here. You probably think that if an animal goes extinct, the species is gone forever. But here are some animals who came back from extinction. Be warned though, some of these are so scary, you may wish they stayed extinct. First, we have to look at the New Guinea singing dog. Right now, you are looking at the most ancient living dog. This dog species is hundreds of thousands of years old. The dog has been feared extinct for more than 50 years, but thankfully this dog was rediscovered in the forests and highlands of New Guinea. In the 1970s, one scientist said these dogs had definitely gone extinct. It was only in 2022 that they were found once again. Cameras documented at least 15 of these wild dogs in the highlands. This included males, females, and cubs. They were found on Punkak Jaya. That's one of the largest and most isolated mountains in New Guinea. It's almost like these dogs were hiding from us humans. They're famous for their very unique singing. Their howl does not sound scary at all. It's very high-pitched and sounds like singing. Between 2005 and 2012, there had been sightings of these dogs, but none had been confirmed nor caught on camera. Thankfully, we now have evidence that these dogs are alive and well. Next, we have to look at the Pygmy Tarsier. This is one of the most bizarre looking animals you'll see in your life. These are found in Indonesia, and are the smallest primate species in the whole country. Pygmy tarsiers are about the size of a small mouse. They measure 4 inches and weigh around 2 pounds. Their wide eyes and big ears make them look very cute. Since 1920, scientists believed this animal was extinct. But 80 years later, in 2000, a scientist went to Indonesia. They wanted to confirm the pygmy tarsier was totally extinct. But to their surprise, they found a live pygmy tarsier. Many other scientists had come before him, but they all failed. It's unknown how many of these exist in the wild. That's why they're still said to be very endangered. But in recent years, some have been caught on camera. And right now, scientists are working on finding more of them. Now we have to look at the Smilodon. This is one of the scariest extinct animals I've ever seen. Smilodons are very vicious creatures. They were known for hunting and eating thick-skinned prey. This includes bison, horses, and macedons. Smilodons had very short but strong legs. This meant they weren't fast, but they could jump very far. They also had gigantic saber-like teeth. This would be enough to put an end to any prey. A few years back, this Smilodon was seen in Los Angeles. Many believed it to be real, but it turned out to be a very realistic puppet. But don't relax just yet. In the near future, Smilodons may be brought back to life. Although they went extinct around 11,000 years ago, we do have lots of their remains. This includes their fur, their bones, and even their stem cells. It's believed using cloning technology, scientists could bring these back to life. Tell me, would it be cool to have a Smilodon as a pet? Or would you find that just a bit too scary? Moving on, let's look at the Chacoan Peccary. The Chacoan Peccary was one of the largest mammals in South America. In the 1930s, these were discovered thanks to fossils. No one imagined they could still be around today, so they were declared extinct. But in the 1970s, a zoologist found one. Chacoan Peccaries are rarely seen by humans. They hang out in the most dense areas of the jungle, hence their nickname, Pigs from Green Hell. They also have to walk through thorny plants in the jungle, and because of this, over many years, they've developed very thick skin. To this day, they're very rare, and you'll never see one in your life unless you go and look. But they do still live in Paraguay, Bolivia, and Argentina. Now, let's look at the Hispanolian Solenodon. That name is quite the mouthful. These tiny creatures look very cute and kind of weird. Some describe them as a mix between a mouse and a pig. For many years, they were declared extinct, but they can actually be found in Cuba, Haiti, and the Dominican Republic. They were only found recently by a Dominican zoologist. But even if these look cute, do not go anywhere near them. Hispanolian Selenodons are one of the very few venomous mammals. They can spit venom from their mouth. They do this to take the life of their prey. Their venom can kill an animal as big as a chicken, and even other Hispanolian Selenodons. These animals sometimes get into fights with one another, and oftentimes only one of them makes it out alive. Now let's go underwater and look at the Colacanth. Colacanths became extinct in the late Jurassic period. That's around 145 million years ago. 
But remember, 95% of our oceans are unexplored. So everyone assumed they'd gone extinct. But in 1938, off the coast of South Africa, one was caught. You can actually see this today in the East London Museum. Today, the fish is stuffed. But scientists have analyzed it and confirmed it really is a colocanth. It's amazing to think this same species was around 145 million years ago. Moving on, let's look at the Madagascar Serpent Eagle. This large eagle can only be found in Madagascar. It's one of the most endangered birds in the world. They hide out in the rainforest, going after very big prey. For many years, these were said to be extinct. But in 1993, a researcher found one. The scientist was walking in the forest of northeastern Madagascar. That's when he saw the presumed extinct bird bird eating a snake. This was the first time this bird had been seen in over 60 years. It's believed there's only 120 of these birds left on Earth today. So while they're not yet extinct, they may go extinct within your lifetime. Moving on, let's look at one of the most majestic animals assumed to be extinct. This is the Caspian Horse. These are one of the oldest horse breeds in the world. They can date back to 3000 BC. For more than 1000 years, the Caspian Horse was thought to be extinct. That was until it was rediscovered in 1965. They were found by an American researcher in Iran. To this day, Iran is the country with the highest population of Caspian horses. It's a good thing this majestic animal is still with us today. Finally, we have to look at the woolly mammoth. The woolly mammoth is basically a gigantic elephant with tusks. They went extinct around 10,000 years ago. Now, there have been some unconfirmed sightings in Siberia, but according to the science, these guys are extinct. For many years, it was thought they went extinct during the Ice Age. But recently, woolly mammoth remains have been found on Wrangell Island. It's believed these woolly mammoths were around only 4,000 years ago. It's believed there were over 1,000 woolly mammoths living on this island. Today, scientists are using woolly mammoth remains to try and bring them back to life. Because they lived in cold climates, woolly mammoth remains are intact. Most recently, in 1997, a boy found a frozen woolly mammoth in Siberia. These woolly mammoths are kept intact naturally thanks to ice. By using things like stem cell technology, we may soon be able to bring woolly mammoths out of extinction and back to life. Just imagine seeing these roaming around your city. But now it's time for you to make your voice heard. Which of these animals did you think was the most amazing? Comment below. If you want to see my short videos, then check out my shorts channel. I've been Charlie, thanks for watching. Leave a like if you enjoyed. And if you haven't already, then what are you waiting for? Subscribe to Top 10.